Hey guys, stays on Schizophrenia and All or Nothing. Schizophrenia and All or Nothing. But before we get to this, please allow my brief prelude. As you know, I conveniently recorded it for our mutual comfort, our mutual convenience, and our mutual luxury. And hey, listen, I'm no spring chicken. I'll tell you a quick story. People come up to me all the time and say, you know, you look like a spring chicken. I say, no, 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 no. But um, therefore, uh, I'm not a spring chicken. And therefore, I've been around a few preludes in my many years. And I'll tell you, this kid, this prelude, has got something that's particularly luxurious. Like uh, pancakes or waffles. Hello there, my name is Robert. I'll go Francis. with the pancakes every time over the waffles. Every time pancakes. Me and the bird. The bird's on That's vacation, right, right. We schizophrenia. so I can introduce my new book. This Who's is the cut who in schizophrenia? Right Who? Who? I'm a licensed clinical social worker times 15 Who's years. Who? That's a lot of gabbing and chatting. Everybody now. I've been diagnosed Who's with schizophrenia who? for a score of five and one. Rock and, and roll. Puts a little grief like in my who? beard. Thank you for joining me on my channel. Now to topic. To topic. To topic. To topic. All or nothing thinking is a cognitive distortion. It used to play out this way for me. If I was at work and I was uh, triggered to psychosis around people, I would immediately think, everybody knows, that's it, that's it. Everybody knows I'm psychotic. Everybody knows I'm having psychosis. Everybody knows, everybody knows, everybody knows. I can't go back, I can't go back. All or nothing thinking. I got triggered, and I thought everybody in the social environment knew I was triggered and psychotic. And uh, I would say to myself, well, that's it, I got to quit. Or I can't go back there. Or that social environment is void now. I can't go back to that situation. Can't go back to that job, can't do... It was completely all or nothing thinking. Totally thought, whenever I got triggered, that was it. It was over. The cat's out of the bag. Psychotic is out of the bag. Everybody knows. Game over. All or nothing thinking. Classic all or nothing thinking. Entirely distorted. Because now I've learned, I get triggered all the time. And now I know, not everybody knows. And additionally, I don't even care anymore. But I certainly know that it uh, that everybody in the social environment is not privy to my internal triggers like I once thought. So it used to be all. Now I'm triggered all the time and I don't care in the social environment. I get triggered and I'm like, okay, I got triggered, I got triggered. Not everybody knows. Nobody knows nothing. Just happened one time, no big deal, no big deal. I get triggered all the time and go back all the time to the same situation. But before I never did... Because it was all or nothing. I was like, ah, the cat's out of the bag. I overgeneralized, totally overgeneralized. It's all or nothing thinking. An unnecessary cognitive distortion. But I'll tell you what's not unnecessary are the pancakes. I'll take the pancakes over the waffles every time. Uh, every time. Every time. A little butter and syrup and uh, maybe a little uh, blueberry on top. I'm, I got to go get a pancake. I'll see you next time.